हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई से अकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड वोल्टेज डिवाइडर बायासिंग ऑफ मॉसफेट और बायासिंग बाय फिक्सिंग वीजी वोल्टेज डिवाइडर बायासिंग इज आल्सो नोन एज बायासिंग बाय फिक्सिंग वीजी दिस इज द सर्किट फॉर वोल्टेज डिवाइडर बायासिंग ऑफ मॉसफेट हियर आर डी इज द रेजिस्टेंस across a drain or output resistance rs is the source biasing resistance r1 and r2 are voltage divider bias resistors cc1 and cc2 are coupling capacitors id is the drain current vgs is gate to source voltage vdd is the power supply vds is the drain to source voltage or output voltage here vgs will be the input voltage we know the drain current can be given as k into vgs minus vth whole square here k is constant the value of k is nothing but 1 by 2 kn w by l here drain current is also written as ig plus is so drain current will be equal to gate current plus source current here gate current ig will be assumed to be zero therefore id will be equal to is that's why across the source terminal instead of writing is we have written it as id itself because theoretically we assume gate current as zero since practically gate current will be very very small similar to voltage divider bias circuit of bjt first we will simplify the input side of the voltage divider bias circuit of mosfet let us consider the input circuit let us use thevenin's theorem to find thevenin's voltage and thevenin's resistor so thevenin's voltage can be given as if we find thevenin's voltage between vg and ground we can write it as r2 divided by r1 plus r2 into vdd so resistance in that branch where we are measuring the voltage divided by sum of the resistances multiplied by source voltage so it will be r2 divided by r1 plus r2 into vdd thevenin's resistance can be found by taking r1 parallel with r2 that will be equal to r1 r2 divided by r1 plus r2 so thevenin's voltage is nothing but vg voltage across gate and thevenin's resistance is nothing but rg which is resistance across gate terminal so instead of using this circuit across the input we can use a single voltage source which is equal to vg and a single resistance which is equal to rg that will be connected to remaining part of the circuit so this is the thevenin's equivalent circuit after simplification of the input side at the input side instead of connecting resistor r1 and r2 we have simplified and we have written vg and rg which is equal to these values here ig is assumed to be zero so we'll keep the output side as it is it will not be changed now let us apply kvl to input side so if we apply kvl to input side we will get vg minus ig rg minus vgs minus id rs will be equal to 0 so we can write vg minus ig rg minus vgs minus id rs will be equal to 0 here ig rg will be equal to 0 since ig is assumed to be 0 so we can write vg minus vgs 
minus Vs will be equal to 0. So in place of IDRS, we have written it as Vs. So from the above equation, we can write Vgs is equal to Vg minus Vs. So this is the expression for input voltage. Now if we apply KVL to output side, we can write it as VDD minus IDRD minus VDS minus IDRS is equal to 0. So we can write VDD minus IDRD minus VDS minus IDRS is equal to 0. If we take ID as common from these two terms, we can write VDD minus VDS minus ID into RD plus RS is equal to 0. From this, we can find the expression for ID which is equal to VDD minus VDS divided by RD plus RS. From this equation, we can find the expression for VDS, which is output voltage. So we can write VDS is equal to VDD minus ID into RD plus RS. So this is the expression for VDS. This is about voltage divided by us using MOSFET. Hope you have understood the topic. Thank you.